what they've invested in their homes with property values dropping, they're in a panic. Residents who live in the Whitehall neighborhood in Northwest Columbia bordering I-26 speaking out tonight about a proposed bridge by the State Transportation Department. It's part of the Carolina Crossroads project and neighbors are doing everything they can to stop it. News 19's Alicia Niaves tells us more. That's where the actual stop sign is going to be. Barry Amick says if a new bridge proposed by the Transportation Department is built, well, the, the project would hit about 150 feet away from his mother's house. We're really concerned about all the traffic, the crime. Neighbors tell us they just found out about the project a few weeks ago. Here's the plan. As part of the Carolina Crossroads project, transportation leaders want to build a bridge over I-26, connecting Beatty Road to Tram Road in Whitehall. A stop sign will also be installed on Tram Road leading to the bridge. First we were told it had something to do with the malfunction junction and then they changed that tune and that's not supposed to control traffic. So we can't really get a direct answer as far as exactly why they're going to put it. The robbery, robbery, car break-ins. Amick worries the bridge would shift suspicious behavior to their peaceful neighborhood. Property values are going to plummet just because of the simple fact that uh, when you bring crime back in this area, speeders all day long and uh, cars at high rates of speed, nobody's going to want to live here. We have five school bus stops in here, and this is 25 miles an hour down here. This one absolutely needs to be taken out. Lexington uh, Representative okay. Chip Huggins, who oversees the area, says it's not just Whitehall that's against the project, and many still have no idea about the proposal. I can tell you that the three to five million dollars, which is the estimation on this, would be much better used spent in other places. He says meetings on the topic have been overflowing with residents who expressed safety concerns to the DOT. They're giving reasons. They're not just doing it because they don't want it in their backyard. There are reasons. There's flooding, there's traffic, lots of noise. This is our community. We know what's best for our community and this bridge is absolutely not needed for our community. Residents have until September 17th to submit comments to the Transportation Department about the bridge. This is our crown jewel, Whitehall, and uh, we're trying to keep it that way. Alicia Niavis, News 19, WLTX. And we did reach out to the Transportation Department for comment about all of this, but they were unavailable.